guys, deluded. Now, I'm a big fan of not hyping kids. Like, I really hate it. It doesn't matter if you go on any scouting, people that claim to be scouting websites, you go on websites, you go on any youth enthusiasm, um, enthusiasts, especially the Twitter ones, they all claim to know everything about every young player playing for every club abroad and here, and it just doesn't make sense. I mean, I can tell you for a fact this is what they're doing. They're looking at under 15 and under 16 England squads and just taking their names and tweeting or or or, or Facebooking or just talking out their ass about these players. Think about it. If you do that for about 20 names of players that nobody else knows, you're going to be right against one. And that's that's, that's something I've always realised from school. A lot of people are insecure, don't know what the hell they're talking about. So I don't like talking about players that are not scholars and things like that because I do believe we shouldn't know about them. But there's a player called Nal John that plays for Spurs. I think this guy, I don't, again, he was 15 at the time right, when I saw him. But I do believe, again, I don't want to say he can go to the top and do this and that. But I do believe he's got the real potential to at least make the, um, be on the journey, the pathway to that. Um, allegedly, my knowledge is limit, limited of him. I've literally, I, the only reason I know exactly who this player is is because a family member of mine was trialling at Spurs. And he was actually in that age group. And I must admit, I thought Nal John was in, um, I watched him play in training. And I also watched him play a couple games and I must admit I was surprised I thought he was an under 16s player I thought he was a player going to sign a scholarship this year he's actually an, at the time under 15s now under 16s where now he'll sign a scholarship you see me tweet about him I'm, for me what impresses me is this he's very strong for a young man and his technical abilities like I've, I have limited knowledge on the player but his technical abilities are quality like he's very comfortable with his ball at his feet, very comfortable changing directions, very comfortable with the link up play. For um he's very strong, like I said. He was decent at set pieces and he was a decent dribbler. For me, I assume he's a midfielder. He, he was playing in midfield, but I, I did a bit of research out of that and apparently he's a striker. Um and I have seen him now um in the England under sixteen squad with um Pantino, a player I've made a video on former Luton boy he came to Arsenal, who should be turning scholar this year as well. Um there's also another um, Arsenal player there, and I'm going to do my research of that player because I've never seen them before. But if they're getting in the England squad, obviously everyone can get in the England squad at under 16s to a degree if you've got potential. You want to just have a bit more knowledge on them. But in my limited knowledge, I think now John for Spurs is one that people could look out for. And I know I'm the deluded gooner, but I'm a football man first. So I talk about football. I talk about, like someone said, I have an assortment of content. I talk about conscientious topics, about youth football, about um tactics and just about anything that captures my attention and that's why you guys love me man like i'm so different like yeah man there's nothing more to say on this front man without waffling so yeah apologies for the quick vid like i said but i can't talk i can't talk more about a man i don't know much more about all i know is that he's got great technical qualities and he could be one along with i'm looking at that 17 year old skip of spurs two that I'm looking for in the next couple of years to be fair with you Spurs so got a lot, number of kids as well but I like Skip the defensive midfielder centre midfielder whatever you want to class him as so yeah man guys deluded getting a comment subscribe and do the rest I'm out thank you very much for watching and now John I hope you become the player you can be and I hope obviously you're given a full time scholarship at Spurs